Okay. That wasn't really funny. Evening, you uh, demons of the night that has weird things in your foreheads. This is Gurgling Pits of Metal and uh, today we're going to review an album called From Beyond by the band Massacre from Tampa Bay, Florida. It was released in 1991. The album artwork was drawn by Mr. Ed Repka and uh, as I said it was released in 1991. Uh, there are a couple of re-releases uh, though this one is the original from vinyl apparently. <laughs> but uh, you can also see that because of the uh, the colors on this one is kind of a pink, purple, while the other ones are kind of blue or of a bluish kind and From Beyond is actually written like so and not just a little From Beyond We're going to listen to the song Dawn of Eternity which is actually late, one of my latest favorite songs to listen to It has this storm beginning like rain shattering against the glass winds going at you and you stand just outside and you hear it just blow and all of a sudden you feel this you get this powerful atmosphere into the music like this much like cancer when it was waving motions in the beginning of uh, Well, uh, I also want to put one thing straight off just before the song really gets the start. Ah, we'll take it after the song. Massive, you want to slit your own fucking wrist to it. Not the fucking wrist, you know, throat. I just hope to, you know, reach Satan and just, I don't know, kill him or something. I, I don't care, I just want to kill when I hear it. And that was a direct quote from one of my pals. When he first heard uh, some thrash band, he was like, Oh, I want to kill! Uh, yeah, well, it will be probably on YouTube. One thing I will actually have to tell you though is... Uh, Last journal entry I said uh, Death Shall Rise was the first album from Cancer. Uh, sorry, first album was To the Gory End and was released before that. Uh, thanks Andrew. <laughs> um, I hope I did this one right. <laughs> uh, well, now we got uh, Niklas little little wisdom word and then I'm going to actually do a, a new segment on the vlog so Niklas take it away if you don't can drive a <coughs> car buy a lot of apples you're stupid aren't you buy a bicycle apples buy something but not a car uh, yeah well you're stupid you're a stupid, stupid human! Stupid human! But you said it was a good 
Yeah. Uh, well, it's for... a good movie. I stole that line from. But you said that it was a good voice movie before we start vlogging. Yeah. Well, then you said something like, "If you, if you shouldn't be, if you don't drive a car, you shouldn't, you should buy a bicycle." No. First one was not yeah. a bicycle. Yeah. Well, the first one was just idiotic. It was. Well, we don't have time for this. Yes, Onwards to the little mistake. segment. And I would say, uh, Nicholas, could you improvise a little theme music for this one? A little happy theme music, like... <laughs> no, that's just horrible. Nicholas is now laughing his ass off. Come on, film it! Film it! You asshole. Anyhow. <laughs> this isn't funny anymore. Today's demo, or the week's demo, I would actually say. Trauma side. True maniac. It was only released in 42 copies, and I have number 15. It's a uh, a little demo that goes goes in under 15 minutes, or well, 15 minutes and 3 seconds. It has 8 tracks, and was recorded with only 2 real persons and a drum machine, probably. I don't really know, because I don't think the Toxic Avenger is real. Anyhow, it's a kind of a thrash metal crossover, uh, joke metal weird metal band that uh, was created with uh, the two Swedish guys Ola and Oliver or Olli and uh, well Ola and I would say that uh, try to get a hold of this tape it's hilarious I mean it's not bad shit if you like municipal waste and uh, well thrash Anyhow, uh, uh, do we have any time for playing it? Let's see then. Let make this fast. I actually play tapes. Could you imagine that? No, you couldn't, because you're you're an idiot. Let's play. Damn it. <laughs> Oh, sick. 